All right, now tell us what's going on with your back. Um, this feels like there's several knots in it and like mm -hmm. a dull ache. Mm -hmm. um, this is about oh, two weeks now. Oh, that's your blouse. Okay. <laughs> All right. And so this is going on a couple of weeks. Did you fall or anything like that? No, nope, just woke up one day and it was stiff and it just got progressively worse. And it's keeping you up at night. Every time I move, yeah, I can't, I can't sleep on my right side because that's when it mm -hmm. kind of the achingness seems to be mm -hmm. worse. So what we're going to do is we're going to do some trigger point injections for you here, okay? Because we've already pre-examined you and we're pretty sure that you just have some muscle spasms with trigger points and we're going to do us some injections and see if we can get you some relief, okay? You've already tried muscle relaxer. You've been to a massage therapist. You, did you go to a chiropractor too? No, okay. I, I'm not a fan of them. But you've been to several different kind of, you tried several different modalities and nothing's really helping you. Yes. Okay, so, so it's kind of appropriate for us to try this now. And so we're going to do that. So what I want to do is poke on you a little bit here and find the spots that hurt the most. Most, and you're going to tell me we'll find the four, four spots and, and then we'll inject those. So mm -hmm. that should be one right there. Is that sore? Not really. Okay. You do you have a little muscle there though? How about right there? Mm -hmm. Okay, say up, down, left, right. Uh, right. Is it more in that area? Yeah, well, yeah right, right there. That's right there. Okay, sure. so I'm going to make a little dimple, a little spot, then down from there. Uh, more up, I think. More up from there? Yeah, that's another one about right there. Pretty close, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, part of me is sore too from the massage, so it's hard to tell unless you push a little harder. I if see. it's just a bruise or if that's a. So they were pretty rough, huh? Yeah. How about up in here? Anything? Mm mm. Back over here? Mm mm. That's pretty. Right, it's pretty isolated. Just, yeah, it's pretty How about much, right there? Yeah. Okay, it so seems like there's just one big knot or a bunch of little ones all like a cluster kind of. We can, if we only need three, we'll only do three, but do we need anything further down this way? Does that hurt down in there? Oh, right there. Oh, that does. Yeah. Okay. I didn't realize it, but yeah. Another spot there. All right, so let's go right here. How about here? Anything there? Oh, right there. Right, yep. And then how about right in the middle here? Not so much. A little bit not. Yep, right where that one. Right there. Yep. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six little spots there. Wow. Okay, so we'll do those. Let me get Gummy Jean in here and we will spray those and then give you some little injections. We got Gummy helping now. I'm here. So we already found the spots. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and get that betadine. But I will need you. She's got uh, a couple of little spots right at the uh, top of the. Bra strap. Whatever this is. What do you call this? A camisole? Yeah. You are blocking a I'm little sorry. bit there. I'm going to be right here by you. So there's one spot, two spot, three spots. They look like freckles now. I've lost all our spots that were I found. see them. You see them? Yeah, I see four. There's six. One, two, three, four, five. Let me get the alcohol and make sure we can find them. Definitely. There's three. One, two, three. Four, five. Four, five. And there was we lost the six. There you go, right here. Yep. You may want to mark that one again. Oh, yeah, I think so. Oh, no, that's our freckle. No, there's four. One, two, three, four. No, 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 look. Six. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Four, five, six. We got them all. We got it. We've done this once before, <laughs> but just once. <laughs> This is Goldie. She reminded me Goldie. of Goldie Hawn. All right, so we got a two and a two, so we're using triamcinolone. We're using 1% plain lidocaine, right, Gabby Jean? Yes, sir. All right. We're going to spray some cold spray, then you're going to feel a little bee sting. Are you ready? Everything's going to be. Goldie, are you okay if we video your procedure for all our friends on YouTube? That's fine. All right, go. Stick. Stick. Good. Stick. Sorry, I'm wasting this on you. I think I just froze the needle. Stick. And the next spot's going to be right there. Stick. You're doing good, Gabby Jean. And the last one. I think the cold spray is the worst. <laughs> Is the cold spray the worst or the needle? It didn't really hurt. It just, I could feel it going into the muscle. Oh, <laughs> a couple of deep. Just a little bit of pressure deep in the muscle, yeah. Let me rub this in for you real good here, okay? Here, I got it. I think we're just going to be, we just
just need to put a little, little dressing on this. We're going to put some little bandages on this for you. Oh. You were very brave, Goldie. Oh, I'm going to need you to pass me the band-aids because I'm holding her. I will pass you band-aids. Coming up right now. They're already out. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Oh, yeah, you did get some out, didn't you? Yeah, it's fine. All right, Goldie, I hope that works for you, and I hope you feel better and you get a good night's sleep tonight, okay? I thought I We're going to give you a shot of this, Simvis 1. one. And you've never had this before, but we've done some cortisone shots for you before, right? No, y'all haven't done it for me. Somebody I else has? Yeah, long time. Okay, and the problem with it is, is you've got a bad knee, you know you need a knee, knee replacement, but you're not old enough yet, right? right? They're telling you that you need to get older because mm -hmm. you don't want to outlive a knee replacement if you can possibly, you know, avoid that, yeah. right? All right, Miss Colgate. <laughs> Sensodyne. Sensodyne. <laughs> um, the one thing about that, that people tell me when they, the first time they get the Synvisc 1, it's, it's a lot of medicine, okay? It doesn't hurt any more to get this shot than it does to get just a regular cortisone shot. The problem is, is it takes longer to get the medicine into the knee joint. Right. right? That's number one. So you have no, you end up sitting here longer as I'm squeezing that medicine through a small needle. It's cold, so you're gonna your knee's actually gonna start feeling cold. Okay. And you're gonna feel a lot of pressure. Okay. Okay. So it's not like you're gonna feel pain from the shot, but you are gonna feel like pressure from the inside of the knee. And when you first stand up, it's gonna really feel weird. Right. Okay. All right. It's jelly like, right? It's like jelly. Yeah. Yeah, I don't th I don't think I've ever gotten a one shot cuz back when I was getting them they were three shots. It's mm. chicken jelly. Yeah. That's what oh, it is. Seriously? Yeah, it's chicken jelly. You know. Chicken jelly? You never had chicken jelly before? Mm -hmm. Well, you've had a uh, raspberry jelly, right? Uh, you had strawberry uh, jelly? Oh, yeah, definitely. But you never had any chicken jelly? What is chicken jelly? Nothing, I just made it up. <laughs> No such thing as I'm just either. sitting here thinking about the fat that kind of congeals after yeah. you all that <laughs> that's, what it, that's, what it. That's, what, that's what we're putting in. Oh, okay. That's chicken fat. Okay. Um, no, um, it's made from like synthesized rooster comb. Oh, that's, oh, that's, that's right. right. I yeah. read about that. Right. Yeah, so that's why we call it chicken jelly. Oh, okay. All right, so this is this is the amount. shot it's a it's yeah. a lot of medicine right mm -hmm. and Maybe I should on this side. you want to get on the other side go ahead climb over all right and look through that camera and make sure you can see yes now your knee mm -hmm. i'm going to put you just exactly the best place there we go i'm going with colgate <laughs> now gummy jeans going to spray some cold spray right on that spot okay. and we're going to give you an injection how she does her. that from a distance she's awesome little poke and this is where it looks like I have like even a worse shake than I really have because I have to put a lot of pressure behind this. And you should be feeling cold, but you it shouldn't. Does. Be, it doesn't. Feel, you shouldn't be feeling any sharp pain. Just dull. Get in there, medicine. Ah. Hey, I'm I'm not that shaky today. Mm -hmm. Get in there. Woo. Almost. Is it super done. cold? It's not as cold as. Oh, she's done. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> like that didn't hurt that this bad at all. This is good for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you still will want to ice your knee tonight for about uh, 20 minutes. Do about an hour before you go to bed, okay? Okay. And uh, just take it easy for a couple of days. It is going to feel a little different, all right? Because you, again, will have space between the bones. Right now, you're pretty much bone on bone, right? So you'll have space between the bones again. So it's, you, you'll need to have to adjust a little bit. So be careful that you don't fall. Okay. All right? Well, I can't problem is I don't like to fall. But well, they used to tell me when I'd get it is to kind of like move it around maybe some. Mm -hmm. Let it get in there. Is that yeah. still true? You still want to wiggle it around a little bit there. Yeah. You should already be able to tell a big difference. I can. It's like getting a quart of WD-40 <laughs> kind of squirted in there. How does it open the space? Well, there's so much fluid. Basically, it just pushes open the synovial space, the synovial lining in the knee. It just opens wow. the knee space up. Um, and over a long period of time, usually about six months, that will your body will absorb, absorb it, it and it'll stop working. Hopefully, you'll get some people get as long as a year out. Of I have gotten a year out of them before. Before when I got three series. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. One of you wrote in and asked this: Hey Adam, I see that Meta Seven gets great reviews. Everybody likes it. Well, almost everybody. There's usually one or two people who say it did nothing for them. Why is that? Well, it's a good question, okay? Why do some people say that Meta7, seen right here, is not doing it for them, right? 
Well, here's the thing. It's a subtle difference. So if you want more energy during the day, you take your Meta 7 in the morning. The first time you take it, you may not even notice, right? Like, yeah, okay, well, I took a supplement. I took a vitamin. No big deal. It doesn't give you a surge of energy 15 minutes later. It's a prolonged release, and you're going to be getting more done in your day. It also builds in your system. So maybe you don't notice it the first day, but two or three days in, you're getting more done. A week in, you're like, wow, I'm very productive. Two weeks in, you're ignoring, you don't need those naps, you're maybe losing more weight, you're getting more done in your day. So some people, they just take a Meta 7, they're like, I didn't notice anything, and they write it off. You can't help that. If you're looking for long-term effects, it makes a difference. Okay, so it's like, it's like somebody saying, well, I ate healthy for a day. Why didn't I lose weight? Well, you ate healthy for a day. That's why you didn't lose weight. It's something you're going to stick to. Look at the reviews on Meta 7 90 Day. People have tried it. It's got like a 4.75 rating on Amazon. People have tried it. They like it. They stick with it for a long period of time. It really makes a difference. So stick with it. Meta 7 is amazing. All right, thanks for watching. Go ahead and pick some up. There's a link below. Do you love Dr. Gilmore's cyst bursting, pimple popping, and infection draining videos? Want to see the extended procedures with never before seen footage, early releases, and no ads? Then support us on Patreon for dozens of HD ad free videos. And don't worry, you can still watch on YouTube for free. But if you want the premium content with no ads, become a patron on Patreon. There's a link in the description.